you doing? I hope you are all fine. For those who are not fine, do not worry. Only remember to pray to God and you're going to be all right. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for your support. I appreciate much. For the new ones, you are welcome. Please don't leave this channel without subscribing. Subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you get notified whenever I upload a new video. And let us jump into our today's video right now. Today's video, guys, is going to be a girl's talk. But attention, if you're a man watching this now, don't run just because I've said it's a girl's talk. No, you're going to be benefiting from this video, I promise you. Because some of the tips I'm going to be sharing, they might help your girlfriend, your wife, or your little sister. So stick here. <laughs> Don't go away, please. This video was requested by my friend, my subscriber. She is a content creator too. Her name is Parenting Abroad. I'm going to be sharing her link. So she requested I do a video about the best fragrances for women and that is what I'm going to be sharing with you today. When we talk of taking a good care of yourself as a woman, you need to smell good. Smelling good is among of the important thing that you should do as in taking care of yourself because when you smell good, you feel very confident. It gives you some kind of power, you know. <laughs> you feel powerful because you are very sure you're smelling good. <laughs> but when you smell bad, then it's very bad because you affect even people surrounding you. Example, people you work with or your partner, your husband, you know. So it's very good to smell good. <laughs> and this brings me to one of the story. I want to give you a bit of a story, you know, I'm a story girl. So back in the days, I used to work with this girl and she did not like care. she did not care at all of how she takes care of herself. She used to have this bad smell. Whenever she could enter the office, everyone could just be like, oh my god. Because she could smell bad. But this girl had a very bad temper also. Short-tempered people, you know, even if you tell her something for her goodness she will still judge it very differently she will act very strange defend herself you know such kind of a character so no one was courageous enough to confront this girl tell her that she really need to take care of herself and bad enough she was so close to me so my manager told me that why can't you talk to her <laughs> you know <laughs> because uh, she was close to me but I told them that you know I can't do it because she's going to be just defending herself and shouting screaming panicking so in the end we decided that we should have like a girls lunch out and talk you know talk girls talk like what we're doing now <laughs> So we went for a lunch, we ate afterwards, we danced, and then it was time to just relax. We relaxed, and as we were relaxing, that's when my manager said that, uh, I think there is something we need to talk about, and it's about how should a woman clean herself? Like, when we talk of cleanness, how do you understand it? I want everyone to tell me what you think so everyone shared the ideas of cleaning yourself and all that and even herself also shared <laughs> the tips on how to be clean and some of the girls uh, proposed that uh, you need to as a woman you need to have some fragrances to make you smell good then it went so well we went home and the second day uh, <laughs> it was really really a new day and a new beginning for that girl she came very clean her hair very good smelling good wearing uh, dressed up very good and when we're about to go out of the office you know as girls single girls 
you just need some touch-ups <laughs> spray some perfumes or spray or if you have a body mist and guess what guys this girl had a new spray everyone's like oh you have a spray please give me you know just to make her not feel bad so it really changed her that's why i said you need to smell good because if you smell bad it will affect people surrounding you so let us go to our tip number one because you need to know these tips before you apply any any fragrance on your body these are so important because if you don't know these tips, then you'll always do it wrong and you might end up not smelling good, but you might worsen the situation. So let us go into our tip number one before I start sharing those best fragrances. Tip number one, which is so important, before you apply any fragrance or you buy any fragrance, you need to do is to clean yourself. I know some people might be like, is she crazy? Does she think that we don't know how to clean ourselves? No, <laughs> you might know, but I'm insisting. Or if you don't know, then it's time to learn. Clean yourself very well. And you might say that I have a very busy schedule. I cannot, I don't have time to clean myself very well. No, you need to clean yourself. Find time. If you shower in the morning and in the evening, then use the evening time to clean yourself very well so that in the morning you can just you know clean yourself fast and go to work or wherever you want to go but clean yourself very well starting with your hair clean your hair very well and i'm saying this because some of us women of color we do braids we do extensions we don't clean our hair <laughs> <laughs> so often but please make sure your hair don't smell because if your hair smells no matter what kind of perfume you use or no matter how expensive it is or how good it smells it is going to smell bad because you smell hair so wash your hair very well with shampoo <laughs> and some other hair products Another place you need to clean very well is behind your ears, inside ears, inside your nose because I've met some women who smell nose. It's a very bad smell. Don't ever wish for it. <laughs> so clean your nose very well. Clean your mouth as in brushing your mouth very well because if you smell mouth, when you talk, it's the bad smell that will go out even if you have a very good smelling fragrance will only feel the smell of your mouth so clean your mouth very very well clean here on your neck because it's the place that holds that clean your armpits always shave because there is no bad smell like a smell of unshaved armpits so shave your armpits clean it very well clean your butterfly very well always shaved <laughs> clean it very very well you can clean it with uh, some uh, feminine soap which are so good I have one I can show you like this one it's very good you can use it when you clean your butterfly you smell so good another important place that you should never ignore is this line between your bums this line here when you shower make sure you wash it very very well and behind your knees make sure you wash it very well also clean it because those are the places that holds the dirt make sure that all those places are cleaned so well when you clean yourself like that i promise you i promise you girls that you are going to be smelling so good even if you apply a fragrance that isn't even expensive 
we will still feel the smell of your fragrance because you are all clean. You have cleaned yourself very well. Tip number two is moisturize your skin after shower. Make sure your skin is well moisturized and you can moisturize your skin by using oils like coconut oil, baby oils or body lotions that are very hydrating so it will help you so much. So before applying any fragrances, moisturize your skin. As for me, I use baby oils and, and body lotions. I have this one. These are so good for moisturizing, but in most cases I use oils because they work so much as in moisturizing the skin. Tip number three is how to apply it. How do you apply it? Because you might be applying your fragrance and after some time it smells very different, like it has changed the smell to bad smell, or you might be applying your fragrance and it ends so fast. After a few hours, you don't feel the fragrance anymore. And the reason is you are doing it wrong because it doesn't matter the price of your fragrance. What matters is how you apply it. You need to do it right. So how do we apply it? So I'll show you how I apply my fragrance. I apply it to my hair and how I apply it I showed you last time when I was doing my video about curly hair I just put a drop of the perfume into the water that I spray in my hair or if I'm not spraying any water mineral water to my hair I just uh, spray my perfume in my comb that I use to comb my hair and comb with it or you might just apply just some few sprays to your hair you know and as you move your hair will just give the good smell and you can apply here not here the reason is when you apply here and you wash your hands and now we really wash our hands all the time so when you wash your hands the fragrance will go away but if you apply here it will stay because the water can't go till here it's only the hands that you wash so you'll apply here both sides or you can just spray here and then transfer but don't do this because when you do this you break the fragrance smell so just to do this that's it you have transferred it already and sometimes you can just spray here and here that's it uh, the other place that you need to spray is behind your knees and this is because when you walk out maybe you are seated and you walk out the smell will stay you know <laughs> the smell of your fragrance will stay in that place it will just like because you have passed <laughs> that is why you need to spray behind your knees and another place that I spray but not all women that do that it is in underwears but when I spray on the underwear not in the middle place where the butterflies goes no just outside of the of the like outside of the and where and bras like this place you know this place of the bra here and here or just here you know just to to add it up <laughs> and to make sure it stays because this works a lot it stays for a long time so those are the places that you really need to apply your fragrance and if you do that you will always smell good the whole day it won't go away no matter the price of your fragrance trust me guys <laughs> my number one fragrance that every woman needs is a fresh fragrance and when I say fresh fragrance I mean clean fresh soapy cool beachy flowery and light 
The good thing about fresh fragrances, you can wear them any day, any time, anywhere, guys. You can wear a fresh fragrance because they are light, they are fresh. It's a fresh fragrance. So every woman needs a fresh fragrance. You can start with a body lotion. If a person who uses body lotion, so you can check out those body lotions that smells fresh. As for me, I have this body lotion here. I use this one during spring and summer because it's fresh, it's clean. Or you can also use a hand cream just like this one. It's made of tea tree. It smells fresh. It smells so good. And have you ever greeted someone and you feel like they have left a good smell on your hands? It's because they have used a hand cream. As for me, I have Dolce & Gabbana Cool Blue, this one. It smells so fresh, so clean. I use this perfume during spring and summer because it's fresh, it's clean, it's life, guys. It smells so good. So you can check out this one or you can also check out Chance Chanel. It's also good. It's that kind of a perfume that it's not very strong. You can also check out Versace Yellow Diamond. It smells very good. Miss Dior or any other fresh perfume. You just go and uh, look on the range of the fresh perfumes. Do some research, you know. As for me, I've mentioned those ones. Even Chloe, it's also good uh, because it's not all that strong. So check those ones out. They are so good. They are the best. But first, fresh fragrances. <laughs> My fragrance number two that I think every woman needs is a powerful and strong fragrance. Because as a woman, you need to be strong, you need to be powerful, and you need that fragrance to speak for you. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> so, as for me, I have this Coco Mademoiselle, it's a perfume, it's very strong, it's powerful. A lot of people don't like it, but I really like it because it's a perfume that will stay for you 24 hours. It's very, very good and smells very good, it smells strong and powerful at the same time. But you can check out even Jador, I really like it, it smells really, really good, it's strong and it's very powerful but not like Coco Mademoiselle. <laughs> this is the best as in speaking. <laughs> so guys, my last fragrance that I think every woman needs is a romantic fragrance. And when I say romantic fragrance, I mean it should be seductive, it should be tempting, it should be I want you more. Those kinds of words should come into your mind. It should also smell like chocolate or honey or milk, or vanilla, or cocoa, or butter, <laughs> candy, you know, that kind of scent should come into your mind. So I'm not going to be just recommending you, you buy this or buy this, but if you know the smell or the scent that you need to look for, there are those ones. If you're looking for a romantic fragrance, just check out those ones, those scents that has candy, chocolate, vanilla, coconut, any of your choice, because some people don't like vanilla scent. They just can't stand it. So you can just go on the coconut side. And some people don't like coconut side. They like almond scents. So you can just choose the one of your choice. But I'm helping you to know what are the romantic scents what are the romantic fragrances? The are those ones. As for me, I use uh, Dior Poison Girl, this one. It smells very good. It's a romantic <laughs> perfume. You can also use uh, Black Opum. It's very good. It smells good too. It's a romantic one. You can also use La Vie Belle, I think by Lancome, yes. It really smells so good. You can also check out um, which one else that smells really, really good and it's a romantic uh, fragrance. I think Prada. I've forgotten the name, but if I remember, I'll just put the photo here so that you can see it. So those ones are good. 
you can check them out but if you cannot afford perfumes you can still get romantic scents through body lotions body mists body sprays you still smell romantic and sweet and seductive you know tempting anything you want that sounds romantic as for me i have this body lotion it smells so good so sweet so romantic and also you can use body mists like i would also recommend victoria's secrets body mist please check her out <laughs> because i've been using her body mist for so long and they're very good she has the vanilla one she has the temptation i think i'll put them all here that i'm recommending you can check them out if you like the scent you can just buy it but you don't need to spend a lot just to smell romantic so romantic scents romantic fragrance is very important for a woman if you want your man never to get you out of his head <laughs> or his mind <laughs> i'm saying this because i've been smelling good since then because i like smelling good <laughs> yes and i've used this uh, i think when i was a teenager i've used lovilea if any one of you have ever used that it smells good and it's very cheap i'll put a photo if i get it i've also used smart collection sprays where i think they duplicate these um, designers perfumes because i used to use like coco chanel jador miss dior all those guys smart collection has and they stay for a long time on your skin <laughs> even if they are duplicated their sprays are so good and very very affordable cheap guys so you don't need to spend a lot of money to buy perfumes in order to smell good i'm saying this and i'm insisting on this because a lot of people have refused like to take care of this themselves by giving an excuse of i don't have money i cannot afford the fragrances but no you can still afford because these things that i'm saying they are very very like super cheap but you still smell good even the body mists like this one i've showed you it's seven euro guys you can afford it so that's it guys thank you so much for watching this video till now i really hope you enjoyed it you learned something new if you've liked it give it a thumbs up share with your friends family everyone that you think is going to enjoy this video watch my other videos too write me in the comments below what you think and subscribe to my channel help me grow my channel please help me by subscribing and clicking the notification bell i love you so much you're always here 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 in my heart let us meet in my next video ciao ciao